For today's story, we cover the Pizza Hut chain and the Book It program, which helps the kids learn to read. But today, what the Pizza Hut chain would like them to read is all about drag life culture. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Uncivil Law, where we learn through the misfortunes of others. As always, I hope you'll enjoy this legal education content, and today will be the day I earn that subscription. For today's case, we are talking about Pizza Hut. It's a pizza chain in the United States. When I was in elementary school, there was a program called Book It. Book It was an incentive program to help kids read. For reading various amounts of books, you'd get credit. And in exchange for these credits, you could get free pizza at Pizza Hut, which was an incentive to help the kids read. It helped me read and made me part of who I am today. But now they want them to read about the drag queens, or more appropriately, the drag kids. So let's learn all about how drag culture has influenced the Book It program and Pizza Hut. Let's get started with this. Pizza Hut is facing fierce condemnation from conservatives and other social media critics for promoting a book about drag kids for its Book It Reading Incentive Program. The program continues on so many years later. This program was going on 30 years ago, and it's still going on with helping the kids to read, with the incentive with pizza, but now with the drag queens. Pizza Hut has gone full woke. Now we must make them full broke. Cute. Conservative officer Bridgette Gabriel tweeted, The Book It website features the book Big Wig, which is described as a wonderful read-aloud book that celebrates the universal childhood experience of dressing up and the confidence that comes with putting on a costume. The book is geared towards children in pre-kindergarten up to third grade. The Simon & Schuster website boasts that Bigwig picture book celebrates drag kids. The publisher says the book celebrates drag kids. Okay. In the spirit of Julian is a mermaid, the irrepressible picture book celebrates drag kids individually and self-confidence from the perspective of a fabulous wig, the description cites. This is the publisher's description of the book on their own website. Critics of the children's book lambasted Pizza Hut, with some suggesting a boycott over the wokeness. It, yeah. Big Wig is being featured. Now, it's a featured book to celebrate Pride Month, according to screenshots of an email from Pizza Hut, who has sent, where, where it's since been posted it to email. So not only is it a book that kids can read, it is a book that is being promoted for kids to read about drag culture and becoming the drag queens. Holy God, this is happening in our schools every last moment, and it's everywhere. Even in the book up program, let's just wrap this up. Thus, that brings us to the end of this article about Pizza Hut, featuring the drag kids through its book up program, a reading incentive program. We want the kids to read, and as long as we're ready, reading, let's let them read about the wonders of the drag and living their truths as the drag. Why? And this book, once again, is being directed to the pre-kindergartners through the third grade, but we're not trying to groom them in any way. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Well, that's happening. That brings us to the end of discussion of this article. Thank you so much for being part of the Uncivil Law family. If you enjoyed this legal education content, please hit the subscribe button. It really helps the channel grow. We appreciate your continuing support. Until later, my friends, cheers and goodbye.